High levels of unemployment have always been a hard and constant feature of life in the West End and society has no solutions for them. My work depends on an investment of time. Dear Ella, I give you my heart. I'm so incredibly proud of the final film. I mean, my emotions today are all over the place. Do you know, this has been the culmination of years of work. She couldn't compromise. She had to be a photographer. Tish Murtha's daughter has returned to her Elswick roots in Newcastle to mark the release of the film she's made to honour her mother's legacy. We achieved what we set out to do, which was to celebrate my mum and for her, apart from the work, for her personality to really shine through. She was a fighter. She fought the good fight. She was true to herself and she was true to the medium. You don't meet many people like Tish. She was passionate about documenting what life was really like for people on the margins of society. This was a world she knew, and she used her camera as a form of political activism. She was committed to working class struggle, which is continuous and never ending. She had so much talent, and she just couldn't make a living from photography. She just couldn't do it. It made me very angry to see that your mother wasn't able to make a professional career as a photographer, and she was so talented. We wanted the audience to make up their own mind, but we wanted them to feel, you know, that, that anger. And not just for me, man, but for, you know, every other working class kid out there who hasn't had the chance and isn't going to get the chance in the future. If you want to photograph the tribe, you've got to be part of the tribe. You've got to dance the same dance. The shape of the future is nevertheless clearly discernible.